What's up LNT fam? Welcome back to another video rebuilding 2019 Audi RS3. If you guys haven't seen part one, I'll put a link in the description so you guys can check it out. What the damage was, us repairing the car and all the way to this point. So in this video, we're gonna start the painting process. We're gonna take everything apart and start painting and I'll show you guys how to make this paint job 100% perfect. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new to this channel, uh, you enjoyed this kind of content, go ahead and subscribe and turn on your bell notification because we post new videos every week, new week, new videos. So go ahead and subscribe. Don't forget to like this video as well. Enough of this talk and let's get to work. Just got the Audi inside of the shop so we could start working on it. Right, we're gonna start with this side. Uh, I'm gonna remove this fender and then work my way to this side. I gotta remove the fender and both doors. That should be real quick. Okay, let's go. My friends just removed everything so my job is done for now time for Andre to do his magic we'll start the painting process but let me show you what I did I removed the rear bumper the tail light so we could get in here and paint everything so we're waiting for the glass guy he should be arriving anytime to remove this side window and we'll primer this today and we'll start spraying everything so yeah, something like this, slowly getting somewhere, <laughs> let's go. Andre painted all the doors and fenders yesterday, so we're ready to install them. But let me show you what we're gonna do next. Here's the doors, they're all jammed and ready to go. Can't install them yet, because uh, the quarter was damaged, so we did some repairs. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna paint the quarter and the dog leg first. And then once everything is dry, we'll install the doors and the fender and then we'll paint the whole site at uh, once and plus we gotta paint the hood blend the hood and i uh, paint this fender as well so so that's the next steps that we're gonna go through to paint this car and make it look 100 percent perfect and andre will do his magic once again got the audi in the spray boot masked and ready to go time to spray her this is what it's gonna look We'll paint this and then we'll install the doors and the rest of the front end and then we'll paint the car again. This way it makes it look the best and the cleanest. So double work a little bit but it's okay, no problem.
Andrew painted the quarter, everything looking good, like nothing happened. Let's check it out. Boom, check it out. What happened? Nothing happened. So we're all done with the quarter panel. So next we're gonna start installing both doors. Fender, we gotta paint the hood. I gotta paint this fender and blend this door, so I gotta take the door apart. Something like this, slowly coming together. Let's jump on the doors and we'll go from there. Little progress report, just put everything back together and looking good. Let's take a look at the gaps. Boom, check this out, look at this. Everything is perfect, perfect gaps everywhere. What happened? Nothing happened. Let's go check out this side. This side, same thing. Bada beam, bada boom. So everything is good. Next, uh, we're gonna start taking the door apart because we're gonna have to blend the door, like I said. And I gotta remove the mirror and the door handle and the molding. But let me show you. Yeah, I gotta remove this uh, mirror so we could get paint this whole door completely, this molding and the door handle. And in order to remove the mirror, I gotta remove the door panel, so. Fun stuff, fun stuff. So let's jump on this, knock it out. The car is ready for paint job once again. <laughs> let's go. Getting ready to start painting the Audi. Andre is gonna do his magic once again, and let me show you what we're gonna do. So we're gonna blend this passenger door. We're painting the fender, painting the hood, painting this fender as well, both doors, and we already painted the quarter. So this way we're not touching the quarter, we're just gonna paint the whole side and everything else. And after that, we'll start putting the car back together and pretty much ready for uh, delivery. Let's go. Audi is prepped, masked, and ready to go. I'm just gonna start spraying it. Let's check it out. Boom, look at this. So yeah, we painted the quarter panel already. So right now we're just gonna paint this side, hood, and the fender, and blend the door. And the next day we'll start putting the car back together and pretty much ready for delivery. Let's go. Just painted the Audi and wow, that's all I gotta say. It looks amazing. Let's check it out. Look at this. What happened? Nothing happened. It looks like factory paint. Even better. Look at this. Flawless. No dirt spots, no nothing. Beautiful. Andre killed it once again. We'll pull the car out and start putting everything back together. Pretty much get it ready for wash and detail. Let's go.
just got the Audi out of spray boot the paint is dry and ready to go so we could start putting the car back together and we'll start with the back end we'll put the bumper the tail lights and then we'll jump on this door put the door together and then we'll jump on the other two doors put them together and then for the final we'll put the front end together and you guys might ask hey Vlad how come you didn't paint the fenders and the doors separate and then install everything at once oh well, see my friends once everything is painted and to align all the gaps and everything uh, you might end up scratching the fender and that's not what I want to do so that's why I want to we usually jam everything and start back on the car align all the gaps everything looking good so once the car is painted we could just put the doors together and install the front bumper we wouldn't have to align the gaps and going back and forth you do that before paint so after the paint you just do a clean reassemble and the car is ready for washing detail and delivery so that's why we did this way i know it's a lot more work putting the car back in back out masking everything but i feel like this is the best as far as the quality goes if you don't want to scratch anything so that's how we did it so it is what it is let's go let's start putting it back together Just put the back end together, everything looking good. So now we could jump on the passenger door and start installing it. To reinstall the molding, the mirror, door handle, and then put the door together on the inside trim panel and all that good stuff. So let's go. So we're all done with the passenger door. Everything's back together. Let's check it out. Install the molding, the door handle, the mirror, and then put the trim panel back together. So everything is in working condition. So we're done with this side. Next, we're gonna jump on the driver's side and do the same thing. Put both the doors together and work our way to the front. This side, I gotta put the door handle, the molding, put everything inside and install the door panel. And we're done with the back end and we'll work our way to the front. Just finished with the rear door, everything looking good. Let's check it out. So yeah, I installed the new door handle, molding, glass, and everything inside. So we're all done with this. So next we're gonna jump on the front door, put everything together, and we're almost at the finish line.
put the front door together so we're all done with the doors uh, now we could jump on the front end and put the front end together I already put the bumper completely together just need to install it let's check it out oh brand new bumper looking good so yeah next I'm gonna start installing headlights and then for the final bumper fender liners and we're pretty much done with this project we also replaced driver's side front suspension let me show you guys end up getting a new shock and a control arm so we got a brand new shock and a control arm it recorded me changing the suspension all that stuff but unfortunately I was at the auction the other day buying a new car new project for you guys and somebody had sticky fingers can you believe that somebody stole my GoPro oh I was so words can't even describe how I felt I didn't really care about the GoPro I cared about the footage that I had up there I had over six hours of recording uh, three cars on the on the SD card so and the Audi was one of the cars that I lost some of the footage it is what it is hope you're enjoying the camera if you're watching whoever took that camera enjoy it but it is what it is sucks but we'll continue working but i did lose some footage of doing the suspension and then putting some of the car parts back on the car so i'll work with whatever i got for you guys but that's what happened somebody had really sticky fingers and stole my gopro but hey i end up getting a new gopro G gopro 9 latest and greatest so now we're gonna have even better quality videos for you guys so <laughs> let's go so i guess there is a little benefit from from that but enough of that let's uh, continue working on the car uh, we're gonna start installing headlights and then we'll install the bumper and then fender liners and we're pretty much done and we got two brand new headlights left side and the right side so the whole front end is gonna be brand new so let's open the boxes and start installing the headlights Just took the headlights out of the boxes we got brand new headlights so we just got to transfer the computer because they're naked let me show you what i'm talking about left and the right side and they're naked so no computers no nothing so we're just going to transfer the computers from the old headlights to the new ones and we're ready to start installing them just transfer all the computers so we're ready to start installing them on the car one two three computers on each side so yeah, let's install them and then slap the bumper and we're ready to go. That is it my friends, we're all finished with the Audi and ready to go. We're gonna go for a little test drive, make sure everything is good and the car is ready to go. We'll call the owner and let him know the car is ready for pickup. So I'll take you guys with me on a little test drive, so let's go.
That is it my friends, just took the car for a test drive, drives amazing, everything is good and the car is ready for delivery. So we just called the owner to let him know your car is ready so he's on his way to pick it up. For now, let's go inside and find out who's the lucky winner for the LNC sweater. What do you guys say? Let's do it, let's do it. And the moment we've all been waiting for to find out who's the lucky winner for the LNC uh, giveaway sweater. I do apologize, it took me a little longer than expected to announce the lucky winner, but right now we'll announce the lucky winner. So let's uh, jump in and find out who is going to be the lucky winner. So once again, we'll be using Common Picker. So let's copy paste. Boom, and let's see how many comments we got. We got 100, 200, 300, 400. 501 comment. Thank you guys so much for participating and let's find out who's the lucky winner. Going once, going twice and the lucky winner is... Ta -dum -ta -dum! Robert. Congratulations my friend, you're the lucky winner. Need that giveaway here in New York. Great vehicle. Thank you Robert. Please send me an email with your info and I'll mail out your sweater as soon as I can. So thank you guys once again for participating and see if you didn't win this time, don't worry, you win next time. I'll have plenty more giveaways for you guys. Guess what? I got another giveaway. I'm going to be doing a LNC hat giveaway and all you have to do to enter the giveaway, subscribe to the channel, like this video and drop a comment and next week I'll pick a lucky winner. To get the LNC hat so simple and easy to participate all you have to do is drop a comment and good luck to every single one of you guys and once again thank you guys for watching this video if you're new to this channel you know what to do subscribe don't forget to like this video and I'll catch you guys in the next video До свидания!